Hi everyone, today we have a new Spider-Man Far From Home set. It's the Spider-Man Far From Home Hydra-Man attack, a lovely scenery from Venice, and we get four minifigures. You see Peter Parker, he's half wearing his Spider-Man mask and swinging through the streets of Venice. And here on the back we see MJ in the, in the gondola and a lot of action going on around her. And the set has four bags, some stickers and the instructions. But first, have yourself a super click party. Subscribe. Give this channel a subscribe, press the thumbs up button and leave a comment down below to answer the question of the day. With which superhero would you want to go on holiday? And here we have the first minifigure, it's MJ. And she is wearing some black jeans with a red shirt and a grey hoodie. And she has two facial expressions and a nice print also of the hoodie on the back and a nice black hair piece. And next we have Mysterio and he is wearing this awesome green suit with gold elements and a silver hat without a print. And of course don't forget the cape. <laughs> and on top we have a glass dome which gives this really cool look to it. This combination with the silver hat looks very cool. And he gets two hand shooting elements in this translucent blue. Also very nice. And here we have Peter Parker wearing some jeans with a greyish shirt and a greyish vest on top. And you see part of the Spider-Man suit coming underneath. And he has also two facial expressions. And we get a cool hairpiece for him, but also a half shown Spider-Man mask. For hiding the identity, a little bit difficult. <laughs> but to, uh, to play and make some scenes with it, I think it looks really awesome. I think it's an awesome piece. And Spider-Man gets some web shooting elements. Want to, to swing around through the city. That he can defend everything from above. And one web shooting element to attack right up front. Looks cool. And the next minifigure that we have is Hydro-Man. And I like the, the water element printing that he has on the torso and also here on the face. And more water elements printing uh, going on on the back. Looks cool. And we start with the first build. We are in Venice and Venice is very famous for its, uh, for its kennels and also for the, the gondola. And MJ wants to go and explore the city by the gondola. And off she goes. <laughs> And one of the, the main attacks in Venice happened by the, the water element Hydro-Man in, in a gigantic eruption of water that raises Hydro-Man out, out of the kennels from, uh, from Venice. And we are creating this gigantic form here. It almost looks like an upside down water tornado. Pretty cool. And next we start with the, the building of the Venice scenery. Here we have parts of the sewers. And we attach an exploding uh, play function, which we are going to see further on on the build. And you can see the, the beginning of the bridge. And we have some bars, gives a bit of a uh, decoration on it. And also like that you cannot enter the sewer system from this side. And on the other side of the bridge, you also have a part of the sewer with a leftover piece of uh, pizza and a jam element and a sewer rat <laughs> enjoying the pizza. <laughs> and we connect the two sides and create this, uh, the shape of the bridge. And I forgot one piece underneath, fixed. And let's make the stairs for the bridge on both sides. And also this bridge over the Venice Channel gets an explosive uh, play function. And here we have the floor elements of the bridge. We give it a nice decorative side railing and some pillars at the back. 
And let's test the exploding bridge play function. Works great. And now we're building a nice decorative, like almost temple-like design for on top of the bridge with these uh, white pillars and the arches and some decorative elements on top. Looks very nice. And we have a little pier to get into the gondola. Some steps up. There comes MJ in the gondola exploring Venice. And we put these uh, spider web elements all over the bridge. And we close up the terrace for the other play function. But first we're gonna build the little canal side cafe. It has two small windows. And we build a little coffee machine for some Italian espresso. <laughs> Very cool small design. And some round decorative shapes up front with the arches. And some signs of the cafe, the Florias Cafe. And it gets almost like a sort of church tower, a bell tower on top. which is very cleverly designed in this uh, in such a small space. I like it a lot. And the small rooftop garden. This is uh, really a really spot for Spider-Man to hang out. <laughs> and some nice flowers. And we have a lovely street lantern for some, uh, some light at night when you cruise the canals or uh, you walk over the bridge or you're enjoying a lovely warm summer evening on this cute terrace. And we have an Italian newspaper showing Mysterio. An MJ blasts off the terrace onto the gondola and off she goes. <laughs> I think it's an awesome cute set. Lovely to get some uh, European scenery. And I think also the scenery can be very very useful when you are building a big city. And of course for recreating and role playing the scenes from the Spider-Man Far From Home movie. I hope you enjoyed the video. When you want to see more videos then please subscribe. Thank you for watching. Till next time. Bye bye.